William threw cold water on Harry's face over attempt to make peace can not keep losing not find. Prince Harry was snubbed in his attempt to reconnect with Prince William who wasn't having it, body language expert Blanca Cobb has claimed. Prince William showed signs during the unveiling of Princess Diana's statue in Kensington Palace last year that he is not willing to reconcile with his brother Prince Harry. This weekend will mark two years since Harry, 37, and his wife Meghan Markle, 40, dramatically announced that they would step back from their royal roles. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex now live in Montecito, California with their two children, Archie and Lilibet. Although Harry and his brother William now live thousands of miles apart, the pair met up in person last year. Body language expert Blanca Cobb analyzed the interaction between the siblings during the event that took place at the Sunken Garden in July. She noted that it was their first meeting since the funeral of their grandfather, Prince Philip in April. Despite their smiles, they reportedly still have a lot of work to do to bring back their once close relationship. The US-based body language expert discussed their interactions after reports that a rift had emerged between the pair. She told Express.co.uk, the one thing that will be interesting moving forward, depending on how much interaction Harry and William have in public, is whether there is any mending of the fences, so to speak, or mending of their relationship. Because when they were together at the unveiling of their mother's statue, Harry made a lot of non-verbal attempts to reconnect to his brother and William wasn't having it. The statue event came after Harry and Meghan's bombshell interview with their friend, Oprah Winfrey. The couple sat down with the US chat show host for a two-hour conversation that was broadcast on ITV and CBS in March last year. In it, Harry addressed the reports that a rift had opened up between him and William. He admitted that he and his elder brother were on different paths but added that he loved William to bits. Ms. Cobb claimed the Sussexes' chat with Oprah was likely a factor in William and Harry's relationship. She said, I believe that it was still all from the Oprah interview and probably some other things that we're not privy to, dynamics in the relationship. Prince Harry had made no secret about his rift with his brother and that they are now on different paths. But Cobb believes that the tension between them stems from the Sussexes' Oprah interview in March last year and probably some other dynamics in the relationship that people are not privy to. She said it would be interesting to see if there would be any changes to their body language when they interact with each other in public again. Meghan Markle remains at the center of controversies despite being no longer a working royal. She and Prince Harry exited the British monarchy in their bid to live a more private life. But, the spotlight seemingly never left them as they have continued to establish their new roles outside the United Kingdom. Recently, she made the headlines once again after an author, who received an OB honor from Queen Elizabeth II, threw new accusations toward her. Barbara Taylor Bradford told the Daily Mail that the Duchess of Sussex tried, and failed, to outshine the British monarch during her time in the royal firm. The A Woman of Substance author claimed that Meghan Markle came to the United Kingdom, thinking that she could be the star of the red carpet. This is despite her being not much more of a starlet in the United States. She continued that the former Hollywood actress did not realize the UK already had a shining star on the red carpet, she stated that it is the Queen, who has been in this position in the last 70 years. Barbara Taylor Bradford, also, asserted that the British monarch is magnificent and divine, adding that Prince William and Kate Middleton grow in stature as days pass by. Amid all the assertions, though, the publication did not include further details to the author's claims. It appears that she did not provide any explanation as to why she has come up with such accusations. But, even so, this is not the first time Meghan Markle received this kind of allegation. Earlier in 2020, another expert had a similar conclusion about the former actress.